Hey guys, Crew of Blind Wave. I'm Eric. I'm Calvin. Aaron. And we're back with the season finale of Loki. Uh, last time on Loki, Loki huh? did his best to figure out how to master time uh, splitting. Time, what's the flow? What you, what's the time thing called? Going through time. Time. Yep, and he did. He figured out the not the when or the what, but slipping. the who. Time slipping. He can Here's rewrite coming. the story. <clears throat> he can. He, he has mastered it, and and now he is going back and fixing the TVA. Yeah. Well, Super we don't know exactly, right? We don't know, but he's going back at least before. How far back? Uh, well, he was at least looking down. I think where. Uh, uh, Timely is going out. Yeah. I think that's where we are. He's looking down the steps where Timely mm -hmm. was. I'm not really yeah. sure exactly, yeah. but we're going to be getting into yeah. all of that. First, we're going to go over oh, our poll from last time, yes. which was, will Don, Mobius, lose his children? It's a very dark poll. Let's see what people said. <laughs> yes. 65% uh, of people said he will get them back. Um, okay. But uh, there's another. Very optimistic. 35% says he will lose them. More than a third. Uh, there's been enough despair as is, so I think by the finale, all the branch timelines will be saved. All the variants can choose to either stay at the TVA or be sent back to the timelines, and Don will continue to live with life with his family, his sons, and his jet skis. He doesn't want the jet skis. He's trying to sell the jet skis. I'm sure that only good things like this will happen, and no bad things will happen, right? He would save his wife? Well, his wife had passed. Or dead? I got the feeling that maybe she was snapped, maybe? You think? Where'd that come from? I don't know. Why would someone leave him? He's such a good dude. Be because he was obsessed with jet skis. Because they didn't have that just makes him more attractive in my Because opinion. she found a more like a jet ski hater, more rich, attractive man. Based on based know. on the uh, the time at which he was, I think it was well before the snap. I think she's just passed. His is in twenty twenty two. Was it? Why does everything look older then? Because I I the noticed. economy's down. Uh, I think he'll get them back. Jetski and Sidu need their father. Uh, Don and his kids are coming back so they can kick Kang's ass while riding on jet skis in secret wars. <laughs> what? No. Okay. Uh, he won't lose them, but the children will lose him. So maybe they don't die and they're out there, but he can't go. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, they won't die. Yeah. But he won't remember them. There are many possibilities, and if we don't like it, we can just go back and fix it. Because nope. Loki can do that now, right? We can go back and give him a vasectomy so we never had kids. Yeah! No! Why, why would that... I don't... Shut up. <laughs> Okay. Time to be brave. Can we save Victor? Good luck. Now Time he takes his own brave. spot again, right? Yeah. That's what he's so is he before. there yet, you think? I don't know. He's... Gonna... There we go. Cool. What could we have done differently? Good question. We took too long. Okay, we'll do it faster. <laughs> they took it. Again. Faster. Okay, okay, no time That's to more argue. Tense. He can do it as many times as he wants to, right? Okay, okay, no time to argue. Look, come on, come on. Listen. Get in, get suited up, get down the gangway as fast as you can. Load the multiplier, hit the green button, launch it, and get back, okay? There's, there's so many steps. You need to go earlier. What happened? He's gone. Again. Not faster. It's over. Earlier. Yeah. Sweet. Again. Oh man, that's Again. even earlier. Can you do this for like ten thousand years? Again. <laughs> I mean, it's possible. Oh, 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 Will it take me to know everything that you know about mechanics, physics, and engineering? <laughs> no. None. Let's assume I don't know much, but I'm a fast learner, and I'm a god. Well, let's start at the beginning, <laughs> then. The beginning. We don't have time for this. Look, it's better if we walk along. Obi, I understand. How long would it take? Decades. S centuries. He's going to be at this a long time. What? <laughs> He's a god. That's amazing. Tape your right thumb, left knee, and face plate, or the temporal radiation will peel your skin right off. What's the first step? Trip has it. Right thumb, left knee, face plate. One last thing. Yes. Whatever you do, do not set the multiplier down. Or it will roll off the gangway. Okay? Don't forget. He's done this many times. I'll be brave. He's like every like thing that every has failed at some mistake. point. Every single mistake. 
He's like reminding him not to do this. Don't do this. What about the iron decoupler? Iron decoupler's fine. We're going to route it directly with the primary compartment. Won't it overheat? No, it's not going to overheat. Because we're going to allow it to interface directly with Tony's adaptive exponential computing system. With all those upgrades, <laughs> it will allow the loom to scale the capacity. He's gone full Dr. Who. Yeah. All right. Go quick. <sighs> what happens if it still fails? He does it again. much effort as fast as you can yep oh uh, the the suit is eroding that's it one step at a time be brave you're being so brave well done oh my gosh you're gonna be like hurry up you know yeah all right oh, come on come on drop come on. it come on don't put it down it's uh -huh. gonna roll off what did i tell you do not put the multiplier down. It will roll off the gangway. Yeah, there's a gap in the, the railing right there. Shit. Hit the green button. That's where he finds out he's colorblind and hits the wrong button. It's like Groot trying to button. Yeah. <laughs> I am good. I am good. I am good. Yeah. I am good. No! <laughs> it can be a little sticky. The green. There we uh, go. It can be a little sticky. Is this the part that's looking yes. Yeah? Now come back. Quick. Quick. Still have to back. save him. Pull him back. Get back. Right? It's working. Good. The rings are widening. I'm gonna go check the systems. It's working! That's it worked. amazing. Did it. it works. Oh, dude. Tom Hills is so good. Wait. What? No. These readings are off. The multiplier was perfect. It did increase the throughput, but there were just too many branches. Damn it. It's a scaling problem. But that's what we were adjusting for. My loom will never be able to accommodate for an infinitely growing multiverse. You can't scale for it. infinite. The only thing that can meet infinite is infinite. Yeah. As soon as the timeline started branching, this was doomed to happen. This is why we have to destroy branches and keep a sacred timeline, huh? You have to protect well, a timeline or else it just keeps going and destroys everything. It goes back to her killing he who remains, right? In the sacred timeline. In the sacred timeline, yeah. I'm saying, like, well, you gotta keep the branches happening. Like, you gotta take them out. Get rid of me! He's gotta go back to then. Mm hmm. Stop. Stop. Wow. Damn. You've been seduced by a throne. The last thing I want is a throne. Sylvie, stop! If you want me to stop, you'll have to kill me. <laughs> Close. Close. Damn it! Zoom. <laughs> if you want to stop me, you'll have to kill me. Uh, he's going to have to kill her, isn't he? Why do you never try to stop her? Fight back! Do something! Oh, yeah, so. <laughs> hey, that was the little thing that she had, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, he froze her. Yeah. How many times have you been at this? Why do you never try to stop her? <laughs> That's what he what said. What did you do? Oh, come on. You're not telling me you haven't learned how to pause time yet. <laughs> I figured you'd be way past that. Okay, when you're ready to have a conversation. Okay. Hmm. Ooh. And what makes you think this is the first time 
We've had this conversation. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see it. Make the hard choice. Break the loom and you cause a war that kills us all. Game over. Or... Killer. <sighs> and we protect what we can. What are you going to do? Finish mm, what I started. So, which is? Claim my throne. No, no, but king of what, exactly? Mm. Cool. Episode one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so let's get Rensler. She knew the hard thing to do was the thing that had to be done. And by hard, I mean impossible. Now, there's no comfort. You just choose your burden. There's nowhere left to go. Uh huh. Okay. She's not paused. The only way that anything survives is if I never kill he who remains in the first place. So you have to kill me. I grew up in apocalypses, Loki. I've lived through enough of them to know that sometimes it's okay to destroy something. If there's a hope that you can replace that thing with something better. <laughs> if you were just right stuck there with he who remains. Huh? What? Nothing. He scanned his head. Yeah, I remember. It wasn't that he showed up. I was like, what? <laughs> You're like Loki's he who remains? No. Actually, I, maybe he I could showed up. Maybe he could replace himself and he could become a he who remains. Hey. Is he going down to do it? I don't understand. I know what I want. I know what kind of god I need to be. For you. For all of us. No! Okay! Is he not just gonna like spaghetti? But your skin! Oh, oh. his clothes are ripping off. Be naked by the time he gets there. He can make clothes. He's wearing his. Oh my oh, god! The horns! <laughs> Fucking. <laughs> That's cool, okay. <laughs> yeah, it is. Dude, they've never been longer. Those are huge. He's ripping the. The he loom apart. Destroying, he's destroying the loom. Yeah. Multiversal war. There it is. The branches are dying. Is he sending signals, or is he he's he's killing the branches? Screensaver. Is he killing the branches, or is he? He said the branches are dying. Is it because keeping them alive? I don't know. <laughs> this imagery is so fucking cool. Oh, there it is. It's the end of time.
shape is more of the vines, the roots. Yeah. The throne? Mm -hmm. Is he gonna become the he who remains? Is that what? The, I don't know what's going on. Huh. Whoa. I think he is. Tree of the Norse mythology. Tree of life. Damn it. No. Damn it. Okay. After. 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 And are we sure she won't try to kill us all? Yeah. No. <laughs> Still. Hey, you. You okay? I got those reports on the variants of he who remains. Do any of them know that we exist yet? Nope. I guess one of them caused a little bit of a ruckus on 616 adjacent realm, but they handled it, so we're all good for now. Is that Ant-Man? Ant -Man? Mm-hmm. Your file. Don. <clears throat> Who he was kind of thing? Yeah. I'm scared it's gonna end without telling me what happened. <laughs> He's the loon. Fixed a crack in the floor. Second edition handbook. Mm. No one gave him a book? Not this time. Is she where prune things end up? Yeah, and the monster here? Or she's just so far back she can't do anything about it. Like a weeping angel. Although it does look like, yeah, it looks like the planes. Ah. Uh, this, this is the TVA? Or stuff from the TVA got sent? Yeah, parts of it. Unless this is the location that the TVA got destroyed. The yard could do with a bit of work. No, it's great. Christ, it's the best house on the block. Never look, never know. You? Yeah. I might just wait here for a little bit. Let time pass. <laughs> Episode. It was really cool. What happened? I'm not exactly sure what happened. I can. I don't like, even know. Uh, like, what do you mean? I want to know. Like, what, like what, what exactly did he do? You think? I mean, he he's grab there him, grab keeping him all. all the branches alive with his god power. Yeah. He's now the god of time in a way, right? Like he's keeping it all so that everyone can live. He's the sacrifice. He's the he who remains. Keeping everything yeah. consistent. I think it's interesting that like he lived centuries trying to save time, 
-hmm. Now he will live centuries. For eternity, to, basically. To save time. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, he's keeping everyone alive and stuff. I think, I think that's where they're going with it. Can now, he do that forever? I mean, he's a god. Yeah. I mean... But, I mean, Odin will last forever. And he was a real powerful god. Yeah, but I, I don't think time really passes where he's at. <laughs> yeah, but, like, if I'm in a place where time doesn't pass, can, does it mean I, can I, like, run forever and not get tired? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, define forever in a place where time does not exist. Um, does he expend energy? Does he have a limit to that energy? How how old was Odin when he died? I don't know. I know Thor's 1,500 around that. Loki's a younger brother. Not, <laughs> but he's not brother, a real brother. But he, I would think it's still implied that he's younger. So, I don't know. Baldur was the king before Odin, right? It was Odin's father. Um, I don't know how long he lived. I don't know. I don't know. He also okay. has time powers. Yeah. So we don't know how sure. that affects him. He's time things. slipping. He's already lived a century. Like one century. At least. Of, right? I don't know how many Said times. centuries later. I don't know how many times he fought, like, Sylvie either. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Yeah, I know. That went for Thousands of years too. ago past here. But, so, yeah, I know. I get you interesting to have that but then like he you know he took all the roots or the branches or whatever yeah. it was and grabbed those and like destroyed the them, loom and then like imbued them with like his energy and his yeah. power and stuff too or, or his time control or both you yeah. know whatever it is and yeah he's hand weaving he doesn't have a loom kind know, of but he turned it into like like we like said like a tree yeah. you know as mm -hmm. opposed to like a, a loom weaving the thread into one it's a tree of branches and stuff living and trees grow which now allows and for is a, Norse mythology visuals based sure yeah. which now allows too for like a multiverse of stuff to happen more so perhaps than what we've yeah. had before you know and they even brought the 616 and also the yeah I don't know microverse thing with the way this is like this could have happened a long time ago or it could happen right now comparing like you know we had Spider-Man with the Spider-Verse stuff going on but mm -hmm. this could have happened before that or during that or after that but still works. I mean, with, with <laughs> Kang yeah. Dynasty and Secret Wars, and I mean, the multiverse is only going to get more complicated and, and more expansive. To have Loki be like the person that's holding that all together can make for some really cool utilization of the character in oh, the sure. later stories. Yeah, you could use him again. Yeah. You don't have to use him again. I'm not even know? saying like I, I I must know what's happening because the visuals are so overwhelmingly uh, dense. That like it, well, the point is to know exactly what's happening, but that Loki is figuring out what's happening. You know, I get that. I'm just so infinitely curious. <laughs> hmm. I guess so. Like when you say like what's happening, like yeah. to what extent do you mean like what's happening? Like, uh, like what's the new status quo with this, and like does he who remains like does does the check ma match? You know, does the chess match happen further, or is this him flipping over the board and starting over his own game? Like you know, obviously Kang is going to be a huge thing, so. If Loki is able to put himself in this situation infinitely, is the only thing that can stop him is another agent to act against him or to do it as long, fight as long as we can, never give up, that type of thing. I, I'm just wondering where we go from here. It's really interesting. I just well, I mean, know, we've like, destroyed the next. loom, so mm -hmm. we will have a multiversal war, I feel like, is where yeah, we're sure. going with that, yeah. right? Um, which we kind of got glimpses of, I guess, in Ant Man, right? Mm -hmm. Even though here they were talking, I think 616 mm -hmm. is talking about an adjacent realm. I think like, that's the yeah. microverse. That's the, the, but they seem to handle realm. it. But yeah. they're watching the one Kang, but yes. not the others that showed up in like the, the after credit scene of it, right? Sure. Because wasn't there like an after credit scene that had like a bunch of Kangs? It was the Council up? of Kang, right? Yeah. Yeah. They, they said they're tracking the variants of He Who Remains, and they don't, they're not aware of us yet. Yeah. But then they also mentioned about the one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm assuming they watched that one. Mm -hmm. It got destroyed. They were like, okay, we're good. But they don't know of all the other ones that were, like, talking and stuff. Um, but I think because he destroyed the loom, like, you open up those branches. They're all there. And because all those branches are there, you now have you these access Kangs. all of them. These they can access here. remains. And they will be fighting and stuff like that, too. Whereas with the sacred timeline, because you're destroying those branches, those other Kangs can never exist. Or they're weaving back into, yeah. Did he grab an infinite whatever. amount of branches? Uh, I it think... It doesn't matter because they're all connected. Yeah, since 
since the multiverse, it, everything is connected to everything else eventually, you, you just grabbed a handful and those those fibers split into other fibers, split into other fibers yeah. infinitely. Te technically, and he's touching all of them. So all roads lead to Loki. Technically, as long as he has one, it would connect to all of them. So, but yeah, Loki has all of them. I don't know if that means that he can. I mean, they were coming out of see them all, or if it means that he can hold them, or if, if he's just there keeping things stable. Like I don't know what that part of it means, but I think he who remains is now going to be like he was no longer there on the throne. Yeah. And so, when he's like, oh, you see a throne, you want it for yourself. He literally did. Mm -hmm. He took it for himself. But it keeps Eventually. everyone alive and stuff, too. I know about like, the That was his last resort. He didn't want it, but he had to. But it was like whenever uh, he showed up and it went, he who remains, you know, whatever said. Welcome, and, he who remains. Yeah. yeah. Like you went, <gasps> but I think that's what he was doing is he was going to take the place of him. I think and at that point, just, yeah, he had already decided what he needed to do. It was just interesting, like all those little tidbits here and there. Do you think he who remains knew this would happen? Um, say I, you know, I know about the time of slipping. I put you on that path, or I, I, I started that path. Or who something paved like the that. Who paved the road for you, or whatever? Yeah, who paved that path? Yeah, yeah. He's familiar with time slipping. I don't think yeah, he gave he, him time. At slipping, the end of but. season one, he was like, "Yeah, you can take my place and sit here for forever if that's what you want," but. I don't think that's what you want. <laughs> but then now it's what he wants. Yeah. Because it's what it means, right? Mm -hmm. He doesn't have to kill Sylvie. He can protect everyone at the TVA and stuff that he cares about. All the friends that he was tr spending so much time last episode trying to save, right? Yeah. Without them, where do I belong, right? Sure. And now with him, where does he belong? He's still keeping track of the, the time. He's got to decide what kind of god he's going to be. He's going to be the god of time. I, I love the beginning with like his Groundhog Day aspect, right? Like where yeah. he's just over and over. Right. And like Go down the like, steps, put on a spacesuit, make sure you put on the visor correctly, yeah. latch the helmet, you know. Yeah. Don't put it down. Like just, <laughs> I like praised the editing last episode, and it's even better this episode. Mm -hmm. like we don't see every iteration, but we get the feeling still that he has done this many times. And mm -hmm. you know, I love him being like, Obi, what do I need to know? To know everything you know, what do I need to know? Yeah. How, How long, long it will it me? take? Centuries. Pretend I don't know anything. <laughs> Centuries later. <laughs> Decades. Centuries. And I liked him going back and having that one conversation with Mobius, too. Which is kind of before Mobius is really friends with him. Mm -hmm. But still. But Mobius was Mobius we, even back then. We hit a lot of points here where yeah. it's like, here's when they fought. Here's when Mobius was here. Here's. Mm -hmm. It was interesting. Yeah. It's good. He it, talked to everyone a little bit before a, he left. It's a cool bookend. I like Mobius, like, going back and seeing himself, but he didn't replace himself there, so I don't know exactly what all he can do or what he's going to do. Sure. But, I don't know, there's something about, like, let me just stay here and let time pass for a minute, you know? Like, peak. Being at the TVA where, like, time doesn't pass. He's I, in, yeah, he's I wonder how that feels. Watching stuff and letting time pass and just, like, just kind of chilling. He's, he's content in that there's a version of him that gets to have his he, life but the he version must, he is can't yeah he must not remember what it feels like to have time pass right i don't know i mean he goes into time and different things too but like he's always he's always been doing stuff and working so when he goes into time into the timeline it's like that too especially he's there for work and he's not enjoying the moment no yeah and here he is and there's no guarantee to saying that like <laughs> this Mobius is that Mobius or that he comes from these things or anything, but he went back somewhere to where that's what that Mobius has and he's just thinking about it, you know? That Dawn. But, I mean, maybe he is. Maybe he is a future version or a variant of this Mobius that they had, they were going to prune and then they just took. I mean, but, yeah. But, I mean, there's different iterations. Like, we saw Loki. How many different Lokis, you know? So, there's other Mobiuses that it could have been. But, infinite amount. Yeah. I don't know why, uh, when did we, did we prune Renslayer Rinslayer? in the conference room. Whenever okay, they, yeah. We tricked her. So she was just waking up. She was just waking yeah. up there. There. Yeah. Uh, but under her is the seal of the TVA. Which means one of two things, right? Yeah. Either at some point way later at the end of time, the TVA is just there's parts of it there, or that where they are in that used to at one point be the TVA until it became this place. Like, either the TVA elements were sent there or it became that, right? Is there any other option that it could be? I feel like those are the only two options. 
uh, as to why that seal is there on the ground. Another option is there's that there. there's infinite options. There, there. Really? Name a third one. Uh, a co- uh, uh, a guy that's obsessed with the TVA but can't take the seal with him made one out of stone from a quarry in Egypt, and then that one got proved. Wasn't that and right? there was a guy that was obsessed with the TVA, and he made one out of the quarry from Afghanistan. And the other one did also Afghanistan, but a mile away from there, where the quarry went. <laughs> I was going to say, <laughs> there's a version maybe where Loki decided to allow the TVA to be destroyed and rebuilt. And that's where it ended up. I like mine too. Because <laughs> he who remains said, like, yeah, it's a failsafe. It's meant to, like, destroy the TVA, but the TVA can be rebuilt. And well, the, it's the meant, timelines will It was remain, meant to right? destroy all the branch timelines and make sure the sacred timeline stayed yeah. consistent. And then, yeah, he could rebuild that. There'd be a new Victor Timely and all that kind of yeah. stuff would happen. And it, the reincarnation that he mentioned, right? Mm-hmm. Hmm. <sighs> it was a cool uh, one. The season's been interesting. I liked it a lot. The last couple episodes have been real good. Yeah. Um, I love Loki's time powers. Great pacing. I mean, six episodes, nice tight story. It was very nothing, tight. Nothing and felt like it lagged. Nothing felt like it wasn't there for. Toit. No, yeah, a little toit. Like a toyga. Yeah. No, yeah. All a, the episodes worked really well. Like, we went from his first time slipping things happening when, in the first episode, him just trying to get things fixed, to that being a very important thing that he needed later on mm-hmm. and stuff, too. And we had some fun things with like what he did with Brad and stuff too. Like I, I, I enjoyed a lot of the story bits in this. I enjoyed this season more than the first season, which is interesting because typically I feel like first seasons are usually what I enjoy the most because that's what really hooks me in. Yeah, but I think this one was pretty good. I think the first season did hook me, but this one like I'm in the boat now. I refuse to compare them. Well, what are we supposed to do then? Find a multiverse in which I like to rank things. It's this one. It's this one, yeah. It's not. It's not this one. It's this one. So pick your favorite pen. No! I like them all. I use them all. The red one, huh? I see, because the red one's sitting there. No, it's just the next one in the the, the cycle. I've used them all. Every time. I use every one. Eric, what's your favorite iteration of Dragon Ball Z? It's evolution, right? Yeah. Dragon Ball Evolution. I refuse it. Rank things I love. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't love that. You I hate don't. it. I like both seasons exactly. of Loki. They're See? both one part of a grander story, which is also one part of another grander story, or which is a one part of another grander story. Are they? Eric, you compared this episode to the last episode in this video. With the editing. I praised both. <laughs> yeah, but you said this one was better. Uh, it had more challenges. Uh, okay, yeah. Lots of... Lots of heavy stuff, lots of amazing imagery, great performances, music on point once again. Um, Jonathan Majors has the pall over him because of like yeah. stuff that you know outside of the show, but again, he did a fantastic, amazing job. <laughs> you know, yes, um, everything this season equal to last season. I really liked Loki more this season than last season. Shut up, Calvin. No, it's, it's I mean, they're fair statements. I just don't want to immediately jump on to Rankin No. Kids. <laughs> I'm not saying that, like, Loki in season one sucked, yeah. but I, the character I, growth I, from season one to season two, it yeah. means more in season two. It's also... Uh, That's all I'm saying. It, what's interesting is that they did in the two seasons, like, it felt like a natural growth of the character, but we've also already had that growth of the character once, and then they deleted that and started them back at the bad guy stage, and mm-hmm. then they've done this again, so it's... It's interesting and weird, and they, it's a different they've taken path. that Loki and put him somewhere else so the other Loki can still exist, and this Loki has been busy. Yep. Recontextualize, right? Like, he's still burdened with glorious purpose. It's just a very selfless purpose compared yeah. to the selfish purpose. There's different yeah. burdens and different glories, and mm-hmm. not all burdens can be glorious. Yeah, this purpose is to keep time intact and, yeah. and protect the ones he cared about. And Thor will never know. Start to sure he will. Nah, I guess he won't. Yeah, he probably he won't know. Do you think he can see his like niece? Maybe. It. Depends how much like control he has to like observe in the timeline. Like I feel like that's more watcher power. You know, that's right? one thing. Can he see anything in the timeline, or is he just there? 
Because, like, how boring would it be where it's like, I am protecting all of time. And you, gotta, you ain't got a fucking clue what's going on, though. <laughs> you know, like, he but probably I, creates the watcher. Like, hey, tell me what's going on. I will. That would be pretty first, interesting. It would be I'll really cool. Right? question. What if? <laughs> no, just tell me what's happening. <laughs> <sighs> all right. Well, we need a poll, right? What was your f- favorite No! Thing? <laughs> <laughs> you knew exactly. All right, guys, uh, make sure you go to blindweb.com for the final poll of Loki. What was your favorite moment in this season? Uh, let us know your, what episode it's from and leave a comment. Let us know what that is for your moment. Uh, and, and make sure you subscribe because there's more Marvel, like Echo. It's a good idea. Stuff coming out January. Soon. Yes. Don't poke out your eyes!